December 23, 2012. Sample Recovery Unit Team Lead Fisher Case reporting on Subject 17, Desmond Miles. The subject was deceased and unattended. Time of death was placed around 0 hundred hours and 7 minutes with conditions favorable for DNA sample recovery. We had some initial concerns about interference in the vault, but given the skill and talent of this team, we were able to capture useful data. I personally retrieved the subject's backpack and extracted a number of objects of interest to undergo detailed analysis. The subject displayed burns to the right hand, severe enough to fuse the bones, indicating some kind of spontaneous, intense burn trauma. Honestly, we've never seen anything like it before. Head, neck, and torso remained in good condition. I hand-selected recovery agents to retrieve fluid samples, blood and saliva. We then commenced material extraction and were able to preserve several exemplary samples. Data analysis and sequencing is already underway and I'm told proceeding with exceptional ease. Thanks to the cloud database and the work of Abstergo Sample Recovery Unit 3, the legacy of Subject 17 will continue uninhibited as Sample 17.